Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Donovan. Um, hit that like and subscribe button. <coughs> Excuse me, if you'd like to be notified of uh, uploads in the future. I decided to go ahead and tell my story about uh, my t descent into hell, so to speak. It was uh, my trip to Durango. Um, so we'll do, do it in sections because it's quite a story to tell. I mean, it deals with kidnapping, you name it, the whole bit. Um, unbelievable, but they, what do they say? Uh, fact is stranger than fiction? Yeah. Well, so the first thing I discover when I get there is um, the job is not what they promised it would be, nor did it pay what it said it would pay. So right away, um, I'm already kind of screwed, so to speak, because uh, I just sold everything I own to move. Um, I get there and uh, discover things aren't are, as they were presented to be. So I'm kind of stuck and not very happy about it. Although I got to tell you, <coughs> the people at Durango are amazing. Well, some. There are some really crazy people out there, let me tell you. Anyway, um, the people I worked with, though, um, I really, really like them. Um, especially my crew. I was a night shift manager. I had a good crew. Um, they were easy to get along with. Uh, they weren't afraid to work. And they just, it was the joy of being around them. I just enjoyed their company. So that was awesome. Um, the liquor store was cool. The customers were amazing. I never had one bad experience with any of those customers. They're always polite. Um, very happy to be there. As you can imagine, they're buying liquor, right? So anyway, uh, but no, they were just, and they, they loved my style. I thought I might stick out like a sore thumb, but, because you all know how I dress. But they were like, man, you, you've got such style, such um, class, blah, blah, blah. Well, that was all fine and good. But then I started having people like bow at my feet as I'm going to and from work or as I'm leaving my motel room. People like hanging outside my hotel room. Um, it was just really weird. Um, There's quite a few people that thought I was Lucifer, believe it or not. I'll tell you more on that later. But um, yeah, um, I'll leave it there for now. I'll come back in a day or so and update you on uh, how things progressed. I mean, it, it got so bad that I had, I had to leave Durango. I had to move out of town. Um, as quickly as possible. That's how scary things got. So anyway, um, thanks for listening. I will be back more with later. Until the next one, be good to yourselves and to each other.